Hi all, I'm back again with another exciting update. Ultimaker Cura 4.11 contains a lot of features that I'm sure many of you will enjoy. So let's not wait any longer and get to it. Take a look around and you will immediately notice we have refreshed over a hundred new icons. These icons are specifically designed to better represent the features they are associated with, giving you instant clarity. And when you scale the window, the user interface will adapt better so you avoid any overlaying icons or menu items. Altogether, this ensures you have a simpler and more informed slicing experience. And of course, it also gives Cura a sleek modern look. We've added an exciting new print setting called Monotonic Top Bottom Order. When you select this setting, the order of the top layers are printed better and this results in parts with smoother top surfaces. You can imagine this is useful if you want to print applications that require good aesthetics or parts that contact sensitive components. For the Ultimaker printer owners out there, we've improved the integration with Digital Library. Starting today, every user with a cloud-connected Ultimaker 3D printer can access this feature from Cura. And for the core feature itself, we've made sure you can open new projects via the quick access menu and a nifty search function ensures you can quickly find the projects you are working on. Both really simplify and streamline your workflow, especially if you are working with others on projects and applications. Of course, this digital library integration is packed in the latest Cura we are releasing today. But if you are using Cura Enterprise 4.10, you can download the updated plugin from the Ultimaker Marketplace to install this. And finally, Cura 4.11 again contains numerous small improvements and bug fixes. For instance, you can now save your third-party material profiles to USB to manually update the S-Line 3D printer's material list. And if you always want to use the latest and greatest, you can now subscribe to Cura Beta and plugin updates so you're immediately alerted when it's there. That's it for now. We hope you will enjoy this and have an even clearer and more streamlined experience. Thank you for watching and be sure to subscribe so you never miss the next update. See you next time.